So what's up everyone? Um, so since I'm trying to do this um, pumpkin look, I'll be using the cream makeup, this brand. Okay, so I tested out on my wrist and do you guys see how horrible pigmented this is? So this is pretty bad. I had a feeling that it was going to be pretty bad. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna try to wipe my face out as much as possible. Um, I do have this, which this is Revlon. It's a, all it is is a cream concealer. It's in the color medium 004, this one. So I think I'm gonna try to wipe my face out as much as possible to kind of um, you know to get this color to really stay you know as much as I can so I'm gonna be looking up a lot so Anyway, I look like a hot mess, don't I? So we're gonna just go ahead and blend this and get my skin as white as possible. To me, this is not white enough. I might have to go whiter. I might have to go whiter. What y'all think? I've been wanting to do a pumpkin, you know, look. I don't know why, but I just was thinking about doing one for a while now. Even before, you know, Halloween came. So, I was like, why not? I think I'm gonna go over my eyes too. Because um, when I put the black on, I'm gonna need the black to definitely show up. Uh, every now and then I'm gonna look in my, um, Compact. I don't have a big mirror. Like I said, I normally do my makeup. If you watch my videos, you know that I I do my makeup standing up a lot of the time. Well, not a lot of the time, all the time. Let's see if we can get this. Oops. Let's see if we can get this to to show a little bit better than what it showed on my, my hand. If not, we're gonna go lighter. I'm gonna put some more concealer, a lighter concealer actually. All right. It's okay if it doesn't look the best. But I need to kind of look like a ghost. What y'all think? Okay, so I'm gonna take some of this um, orange, put it on the back of my hand again, like this. And we're gonna test out a small little spot on my face. And I'm gonna see if, if it's orange enough for me. I'm gonna take a little sponge, I'm gonna dab it.
and this is not orange enough at all gosh this is like the worst freaking orange I had a feeling that it was going to be like this. But, you know, hey. I'm going to go in with my um, concealer palette. I don't want. I'm going to go in with this color right here. Maybe I should go in with white. Huh, let's test a patch out with white first on my wrist and see okay oh shoot I don't think you guys can see that okay let's test another area on my wrist so that way you guys can see okay you see that and take a little bit of this orange and put it right on top and you guys tell me It's still horrible. Ah! Now it's kind of showing a cast of um, white. You know, I think I'm just going to try working with what I've got. And let's see if we could just... I might have to use eyeshadow. This ain't doing Newton. This is giving me like a hint of orange on my face. This might be a fail. I'm not too sure about this, y'all. You know what? I can always go for... Not, well, I'm not going for like a scary pumpkin anyway. I'm just kind of freestyling this pumpkin. Put it this way. Put it that way, actually. So, see now, if I can get it to stay that orange, it would be perfect. But it's not going to. So, we're going to work with what we got. I'm not going to cover my eyes. I'm going to cover some of my forehead. Because we are going to... Definitely gonna have to invest in some better lighting. My fellow YouTubers that do watch me that's been in the game, what kind of lighting do you guys use? I did make a diva ring light, but um I might have to do some layers here. I might require layers. <sighs> Don't just be patient, Maisha. You got this. We are not 
going to give up. actually starting to get orange. Let's go back in and get some more. All right, so now I'm going, I just got done doing a few layers of the orange, as you can see. I left the, um, I left it out on my eyes so I'm gonna go ahead and create. I'm gonna create. Um, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna I'm kind of freestyle it right now. So just bear with me. Just go along with it with me. But what I am gonna take is my Mac cold pencil. I think this is in the color Smolder. Yeah, Smolder. This is my eyeliner. Let's see, I use the hell out of this pencil, but I'm gonna use this to create sorry the lines the outline and I'm gonna fill it in with my gel eyeliner to give it a really dark look and this is by Maybelline eye studio in the color black is black okay so let's get it Okay. No, I don't want anything. I don't want it to be I totally identical. Cuz I think that's You want it to kind of be, you know, A little bit on, on the unique side, I guess, but somewhat. Okay, so this is the outline from my eyes that I'm going to do. And now I'm going to go in with my nudes. My nudes. Okay trying to debate should I do a big mouth
<laughs> that looks silly. I'm going to correct it, y'all. Okay, so I'm going to start filling this junk in. I'm going to take my. Nah. Let's use this brush. I'm going to take another concealer brush, just like this, and we're going to go in. this stuff Okay, you guys, this is what I have so far. So what I'm going to do is, um, see these peaks right here above the lip line of the pumpkin? I'm going to take those going up, but I'm not going to, I'm going to take a black line going up in each one because you know I want to try to create that dimension of the humps that are on the pumpkin so it's not just so flat face like orange so that's what I'm gonna do right now let's see if I can do it okay I'm gonna take some more of that black. Don't be afraid. And just take it up. See, you see what I'm talking about? But I'm we're gonna shade it in, okay? So okay. Now we're going to go ahead and start shading this in. And I think what I'm going to do is take some of, I'm going to take this small brush, well no, I think I'm going to take my other brush. Mm. We're going to take the one that we had before. Hmm. Let's see. I don't want too much on this brush. Too much black on the brush. And you're gonna just try to fade it out.
okay? Fade it out as much as possible. All right, I'll be back in a few. All right, you guys, this is a fail. This is a fail because I noticed I put way too many damn lines in it. And I shouldn't have put the lines where the peaks were. I should have offset it and not have any, so many damn lines going on. But, you know what, to be honest, you can call this whatever the hell you want. But I'm going to call this the pumpkin that fell. I'm going to have to redeem myself and do another one because I know I love doing special effects makeup. I love doing makeup. And this is horrible for this to be my first. And I'm debating if I want to even put this up or not. But um, if you're watching this, that means I did. But fail. All right. Talk to you guys soon. Bye.